Hi, I'm Brent Ryan, a Muddy Muddy Man and team leader of learning and development here at VACA. And prior to that, I was fortunate enough to teach at Parkville College inside the Melbourne Youth Justice Centre for four years. Some of the key themes to consider when homeschooling our children during this unique period include some of the following. Routines, just like your work day and our child's school day, having a routine gives a structure and can help decrease anxiety. Hi, my name's Anita North. Um, I'm a Gunditjmara Mati Mati Torres Strait Islander woman. I'm a mum of um, three, but um, I am homeschooling two of my children and my daughter's in grade one, so she's six. And my son, he is in he's 12 and he's in grade six. There's been some learnings that I've developed from isolation number one. Um, and I think that the, the key and the take home messages would be that um, you need to go over all of your, your child's uh, workload that they have for the day. So I generally have a quick look through the night before, just so I'm up to speed with roughly what the um, routine will be, um, because I've got two children at different spectrums and I've got my own work capacity that I have to commit to as well. Um, for example, my daughter has to be on her Zoom at um, 9.15, so it's important for us to get her up or both of them up so they can be showered and have their breakfast and ready to go by 9.15. Please ensure that you do stick to the, the routine with the breaks. It really, really helps. So kids need to be drinking. They need to go to the Jilawa. Um, if they need to have some have a feed, um, let them do those things because they do do those things at school and um, encourage them to stick to those times too. They know the routine. They've done it. Um, and it will feel more natural and um, more, more like that they're actually at school as well.